you know, this is your part of day, man, for YouTube.com. Today is Saturday about book ingestion. Um, I support that. Rather be uh, sugar cone, uh, fat ingestion, uh, rather than moving fat from one part of your body, injecting it to a, another particular part of your body. Rather be your breast, your butt, or thighs. Uh, I think that's a new technique they're using now. They say more safer than sugar cone. Uh, I support butt ingestion, rather be hormone, steroids, something like that. I mean, I'm not a type of guy who down on me if it's real or if it's fake. I mean, pretty much it's going to have the same action, uh, you know, uh, to subdue a guy or whatever, or make the woman feel more confident about herself. But there are butt ingestion on the black market that you actually kill the women. Cause you go to like one of these so-called uh, back Audi doctors, like the kind you find in the back of an Audi, which not really in the back of Audi, but like uh, you might go to another person's house and they got a little so-called certificate, you know, on the walls, and they got a couple of kids or women that they support to work on. Uh, it's not really that good. If you support to go to a place where it might be close to a hospital, where there are many more doctors in that facility, um, he got a diploma from me, like Auburn University, LaGrange College, Harvard, Columbia, wherever, Princeton, Yale, uh, something that you know. Uh, you know, uh, you know, you just don't want to go to a guy uh, who got a certificate or degree from a butt implant or us. You know what I mean? You know, it, it just don't work that way. It's not that easy. Uh, and, and all of that, look at the price. One thing I learned about life, if you want to think good in life, you don't have to pay for it. And, you know, it, it ain't going to cost you. Um, it's just like education. It like on a car, you might try to fix up. Or anything like that, it's going to cost you. All right? So anytime you get something a little bit too cheap, then use your look out for it. That's simple. Um, so like I said, I, I support the implant culture, I support the artificial breast culture, I support the natural breast, the real breast, people going with it. Uh, I do not think another woman should put down another woman because uh, her breast is not real, or it real but don't look real, or something like that. I think women who are in this condition with their illness should not care about what you know everybody else thinks. If you got breast implant and someone pick at you about okay that one less guy or woman or whatever you're into, you're not going to get to have fun with the breast. So just walk away. You know, it doesn't matter with me and all that stuff. You know, if it makes you feel good, do what you want to do with your money, go for it. You only live once. You're not going to take the money with you when you die. Uh, and the money you do make, you're not going to make you live to be a hundred. You're not going to keep you out of jail if you do something wrong enough. Rather be false allegation of rape, rather be a false allegation of homicide. The money you're making not going to keep you out of jail. Save some money for that, sure, but I will have fun while you're doing that. So, um, my opinion is about book ingestion. I support it, but make sure you go to a person that is certified. You're going to pay some money for it. Look at the facility, the location of it. Uh, go to Angie List. Uh, they might even got list of doctors that might do that for you very uh, affordable and safe. So, um, in my opinion, you know, butt implants, butt ingestion, hormone steroids, vitamins, fish or whatever. I support all of that. I mean, life is too short to go back and forth. Is that real? Is that fake? I mean, you, you know, got to be real to a degree. All right. Um, so, you know, you're not, life is not all about arguing about this and that. It's just about enjoying the best you can, giving everybody a good compliment to each other, and that's it. You know, and you know, live on your canes and you get the bucket. That's the best outcome of your life, really. So, uh, I just want to hear your views about butt implants. Is it really mouth? Is it real fake? Uh, I think white women should have big butts just like black women, they just gotta put more into it. If they eating one can of beans, they gotta eat two can of beans. Instead of drinking a half gallon of milk, they gotta drink a gallon of milk. Uh, so any race should have big booties, 
uh, every race got their own say. So I think every race of women, especially women, to support each other, uh, beauty and talent, instead of putting each other down and all of that stuff. So this is name part of the event from YouTube.com. I'm gonna hear your views and comments. And uh, the Eels book is on the black market or killing women.